What's up everybody, Beginner Baseball Breaks back with another pack opening. Today it's an eBay mystery pack. Uh, it was 25 bucks, and I picked up two of them. Here's what's guaranteed and I'll also link it down below in the description. So $50 plus shipping. Let's see what we got. It was very securely packaged here. Do one at a time here. Um, he also said, or the seller uh, told me to send in my favorite team, and he'd send some cards over. So, favorite team was the Cardinals. So let's see what he put together. This isn't this isn't part of it. Um, just kind of a little personalization, I guess. A little bit of extra. A little bit of an extra something. So that's, that's a nice touch. Um, if I can get this tape off. Hmm. They're really snug in there. There we go. So this is just the Cardinal stuff. We got a Cardinal sticker. Ozzie Smith. Joshua Baez, good prospect. Jordan Montgomery. Tyler O'Neill. Ryan Helsley. Nolan Gorman, who I just gotten my recent um recent top series one pack opening and then michael mcgreevy don't know too much about him but you know nothing crazy but i mean this is still a little uh a nice little touch there i got the score pack um should probably open this first because that was gonna be as good as the other stuff but this is just the uh it comes with one unopened pack so I'm not quite sure who the 1988 rookies are. Let's just see if we can find any Hall of Famers. Phil Doran, Vince Coleman, Barry Larkin, Mark McClemore, Ernie Witt, little sticker thing, Terry Poole, Mikey Hatcher, Jim Lindman, Steve Jeltz, Paul Molitor, Mitch Webster, Shawan Dunstan, Tom Pasiorek, Jeff Robinson, Jim Aker, John Morzano, and Steve Lake. So, you know, nothing crazy from a 1988 score pack, but can't really expect too much out of that. But here's the, the real the meat and potatoes, you could say. Alright, here's the, is this like a pack of multiple cards? I can't tell. I think it is. So we got Andres Jimenez, rookie, numbered to 125. I mean, that's not bad. Then we got Steven Piscotti, he used to be a Cardinal, number two, 2021, 1988 out of 2021. Here's the autograph pack, I'm assuming. Uh, let's go for the commemorative thing first, actually. Here we have Trevor Story. Um, manufactured patch. And we got a Paul Goldschmidt. Game used jersey, is it? Memorabilia. That's nice. Cardinal stuff. I don't know if he puts this together after or before or what, because so far it's some Cardinal stuff. Um, here are the autos. Pete Hansen, St. Louis. Not numbered. And then Gavin Stedman. Not numbered. But, hmm. Or is this? I mean, it's a... I guess it's St. Louis, even though it has a Texas jersey. Never heard of either of those guys, personally. Then we have our, our uh, graded cards. We have a Bill Ortega, another Cardinals player. Uh, an 8. 
don't know much about him either, to be honest. Then we have a Jeremy Illixson, 9.5. Again, never heard of him. Um, but let's get into the second one. It's over here on the ground. Right here we have the pack. We can open this. Tops 1991. I'm not quite sure who's in this one either. But uh, let's find out. Oh, there gum just went flying. Okay. We got a uh, Rex Hudler, Francisco Cabrera, Alan Trammell. Oh, two Alan Tr Trammells. Trammell, Trammell, a record breaker, Kurt Young, Eric Davis, Mark Gubiska, Steve Frey, Bobby Valentine, Jose Okendo, Joe Torre, Dick Schofield, Keith Miller, and Fernando Valenzuela. Some nice vintage cards there. And then let's open this bad boy up. I'm hoping for some more current, you know, slabs. But this is slab, so. I'm gonna try not to see everything before I take it out. Keep the slabs hidden for myself. If I can just. Really in here. And that's all. So the slabs are still in here, so we'll leave them over there for now. Well, let's go with this first. Yeah, so I think he puts this together after because there's been a lot of Cardinal stuff. So we got Tyler O'Neill, manufactured relic, and then a Xander Bogarts. I think that's manufactured, commemorative patch. I think that means it's uh, manufactured. I'm not too sure though. But you know, this is just building stuff on our collection, so it's nice. We have the numbered stuff. And this looks a little more recent. We have else? Trevor Rosenthal. He used to be a Cardinal as well. 2021. 872 by 2021. And then Ramon Laureano. That's out of 249. 153 out of 249. So, you know, not not too shabby. Always take some colorful cards. And it looks like we have a numbered autograph here, too. Um, John, or John, Jose Butto, Butto, first Bowman from, what year is this? 2021. So, you know, he's still... Probably a prospect in some organization. And then Connor Prelip out of 99. Had never never seen these uh college cards before. Kind of unique. Something different. Put it in our little stack over here. And now we have the slabs. First slab. Christian Pache auto out of or 9.5 CSG. Pretty neat. I mean, it's a newer one. And then for our final one, we got Joe Adele prospect card, eight point five. If I look, like I don't see anything off. Oh, I guess it's a little uncentered. You could say something different. You know, newer one. So um, that's that's the haul. That's the. Uh, is it worth it? 50 bucks plus shipping? Eh, I don't know. I mean, it delivered a bunch of different types of stuff. You got slabs, you got autos, you got some numbered stuff, you got some relics, a little bit of everything. But, um, I guess this would probably be the most valuable, uh, most valuable slab, probably most valuable card. Just because he's still young. 
I don't think he's been doing too great, but you know, he still has a uh, potential. Um, same as this. I'm not sure. I'll have to look him up after. Uh, but uh, yeah. Hope you all enjoyed, and uh, see you in the next.